This is an account book uh, kept by George Washington. It's an early account book. It's been in Washington Lee's collection since 1907, but it's one of those pieces that is, again, newly discovered. Not newly, as in the last year or so, but uh, in the last uh, 20 years or so. Um, it, it is an amazing piece because it's early. It is 42 disbound leaves, so it's not a complete account book in the sense of, of a bound volume that we're accustomed to seeing for a store ledger or whatever. Um, this piece actually uh, was Washington's account, accounts kept as guardian for, his, um, for Daniel Park Custis's two children when he married uh, Martha Washington. He, he inherited the guardianship of her two children. This is a piece that descended in the family of Mary Custis Lee, General, Lee's, General Robert E. Lee's wife. In 1861, when she was forced to leave Arlington House, she had many of her possessions, papers, doc, uh, documents, these kinds of things, heirlooms of all descriptions, she had those sent to Richmond. At some point in Richmond, she grew even more fearful, and she had them sent, boxed up and sent to Lexington. Well, in 1864, when word came that Hunter was going to be coming through, uh, was on his way through the valley and would likely burn as much as he could, these materials, which were purported to be in storage <coughs> somewhere out at VMI, she had them boxed up and transported to the countryside and buried. We now know that that burial place was in Brownsburg, Virginia, which is a little hamlet uh, a little bit north of us, near Augusta County border. There is actually accounts of, of Mrs. Lee when she's gone to retrieve these things, weeping because these have been destroyed by moisture and, and she is throwing things away right and left. This has been, has had restoration as much as, as could be done, uh, which accounts for why it's now in this post binding, these individual leaves which also enables us to handle it reasonably well. There have been scans of this done. It is known now to the scholarly world, but it's not something that is often thought of as being at, at, at Washington Lee University. Um, it begins when he takes over the guardianship in 1769 for Jackie and Patsy, the two stepchildren. It ends, the last entry is done the day of Patsy's death in 1773.